Hello, my name is Amanda Jo Ponder and I'm with the ELA Curriculum and Development Team. And today I wanted to talk to you about one of my favorite books, Looking for Alaska by John Green. John Green has also authored other books such as An Abundance of Catherines, Paper Towns, and The Fault in Our Stars. And in fact, this book, Looking for Alaska, won the 2006 Prince Award. This story focuses on Miles, whose friends ironically call him Pudge because he's as thin as a rail, and his search for the great perhaps. He's also obsessed with famous last words. One of his new friends is Alaska Young, a rebellious and flirtatious junior who is also seeking an answer in life, that of how to escape the labyrinth of suffering. It doesn't take long for Pudge to develop a crush on Alaska, and in fact, he says that if people were rain, he would be drizzle and she would be a hurricane. The book is organized by a life event that occurs with Alaska in a circle of friends, so each chapter is numbered so many days before or after the event. In the end, Miles believes he has found his great perhaps by answering Alaska's question. He has realized that to escape the labyrinth of suffering, he has to learn to forgive, not just himself, but others as well. So I hope you learned a lot about John Green's Looking for Alaska, and maybe it'll be the next book choice for you. But if not, stay tuned, and next book talk is on the way.